very, very soon, imminently, we've got our little chat coming up with uh, proprietors of the Furchester Hotel, which is a brand new program. She's going to be on CBeebies from Friday. Um, and it's a sort of collaboration between the BBC and Sesame Street. So how exciting is that? 52 episodes in the bag. We're going to be speaking to uh, Fergus and the Cookie Monster. Uh, she's extremely excited. I'm sure you'll agree. They say it never worked with children or animals, but no one said anything about furry monsters. So it is with some trepidation that I interview my next guests, hoteliers and monsters. Their Thank new you. show, The Furchester Hotel, is coming to CBeebies this coming Friday. It is Fergus Fuzz, the proprietor of, uh, of said establishment, and Cookie Monster. Good morning, boys. Good, Good morning. morning, Sean. Good morning. This is indeed an, a strange and beautiful honour. Oh, I've thank you very much. Well, that nice to hear. <laughs> I think oh. of myself as a hotelier first, monster second. Yeah. Yeah. Um, definitely. We've got to get that right. Do you, do you have little cards made up and everything? You, you well, know, it, to, what, to hand out to people on the way out. That's right. That, yes, yeah. they never seem to come back, though. Yeah. Very weird. <laughs> that problem. Mm. Mm, we hand them out, but... Nobody, yeah. not too much return business. No, not much. No. <laughs> no. Mm. Well, that's, that's, that's a good point, actually, because, I mean, we, we're looking forward to seeing this, uh, this you know, sort of experience unfold on the television. Mm -hmm. But it sounds a bit like a bit of a Faulty Towers vibe going on, really, at the, at the Furchester. Is it what kind yeah. of establishment is it? Is it, is it a luxury hotel? It's pretty much Faulty oh. Towers with monsters. Oh, no, right? we're, we're a world-class half-star hotel. <laughs> half-star, is yeah. it? Yeah, we're the only monster hotel with a half-star rating. We're very proud of that. Mm. Mm. That does take some getting, I suppose. No, it? it's a yeah. lot of hard work. Yes. And is it? I mean, that's. That, I always get that whenever whenever I stay in hotels, I always mm -hmm. feel sorry for the you know for the proprietors and the people that work there. Is, is, oh, it, is right. it as hard work as it seems? Oh no, we love our job. Really? Oh no, we're just there to make you t your stay nice and comfortable, and yeah. you know we'll bend over backwards to help you. Yeah, the customer is always right most Absolutely. of the time. <laughs> if you need a bobsleigh track, you know, built through the hotel, I'll do that for you. Right, no really? problem at all. You uh, you one handy guy. I am. Yeah. You, yeah. Uh, there's nothing. Thing you can't fix. Right? That's see. my motto. So this is one of the things about the Furchester Hotel is that working together, you can you can make just about yeah, anything you, happen. Yeah, you know, it, we sometimes we put our furry heads together mm -hmm. and think. Yeah, that's how we do it. That's we how we solve the mistakes, problems. And then we think them through and we come up with a solution. Yeah, mm. and do you? And I about mean, forty percent of time at work. <laughs> Yeah, not always. That's no, the best no. strike rate, mm. to be fair. Yeah. But, I mean, to be fair, as I always hey, say. Hey, yes. you it's good, tiny, Sean. Just a tiny definitely little joke good. there. I, and you've not seen my back. Uh, as you were saying earlier on, I mean, I definitely could be a furry monster. There's no question yeah, there's about it. There's a lot of hair it. going on in your face there. There is, yeah. There is quite a lot, to be fair. Have to you thought fair. about dyeing it? I blue, maybe. Blue. Is yeah, you see you're color. talking. Yeah, we blue. Mm -hmm. Fergus blue. Yeah, the people on radio. Are you? Because I'm uh, colorblind no, as well. Yet. Cookie Monster. Are you me blue. Of, you're definitely blue, not me, purple. No, me blue. That's it. I should know that. Me fuzzy design, and right? blue. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> and do you, have, we, have we got any cookies, by the way? You got cookies. cookies. Oh, no. Actually, Where are oh, the no, cookies? No, no, cookie. no. Mention Where? the C one. Ah, Please. Ah, ah, so sorry. Oh, no. Where cookie? Cookie. 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 Where? Oh, Where? Whoa, 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 whoa. Cookie monster. Calm we down, cookie. You know what? Cookies. This I, microphone looked pretty delicious. Oh, God, oh, no. No, no we have, I tell you what, we've got some custard mm, creams mm, on the fourth mm, floor. I'll go and get those in a minute. Custard creams. We'll love those. Creams cookie. A little bit of moisture in the middle. terrific. And you've got, um, there's a motto of Furchester never gives never up. Never gives up. So is this, this is the sort of main thrust of the, this, you know, the, this, 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 that binds you all together, this, mm -hmm. the solving of problems. Yeah. Almost mm -hmm. like the MacGyver struck A team of, of the hotel well, industry. Absolutely. That's pretty That's good. That's very good, yes. Is that what we're there's talking about? nothing you can't here? solve with a stick of celery. That's my <laughs> motto. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so if I wanted a club sandwich at three o'clock in the morning or something like that and a, and a strong coffee, that wouldn't be, that would be something that I'd be able to expect at the Furchester. Well, we would try. Yes, definitely. We'd try very hard to get it there. It might take us a few hours. No guarantees. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Easier to get a bobsled, a bobsled track. That we could do. Yeah, no, that I can do reception. no problem at all. That would be okay. That's yeah, right. you, we've had the uh, old porcupine check in. Oh, we yeah. had a skunk. Yeah, we had a super <laughs> rock check in. A that super rock. A super rock. Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't even know what one of those is. Well, it's a rock with a cape. Oh, right. Basically. You know no Super Rock? I've never met Super him. Rock's yeah. amazing. Wow. Mm. Super Rock. We had the squid. Yeah, oh yeah, we've got a squid. Oh, uh, we had a cookie chicken. 
Oh, Remember no, Mr. Crumb? Oh, that was a long day. He learned valuable lesson. No eat the guests. Yeah, the it's point. strict hotel policy. Yeah. yeah. yeah you do, you, it's a, you, the people really do frown on that kind of thing yeah. I mean, in the modern hotel industry. Well, it sounds like a, a lovely... I mean, I very much w would like to, actually. I've got a, a bit of a Christmas uh, holiday I was looking forward to booking in somewhere. I don't know if oh. you have any vacancies around the Christmas period. Oh. I'm pretty sure it's open. No problem. Mm. We'll put you in the DJ suite. In the DJ suite? Oh, oh no. God. We've got rooms for every kind of customer. Oh, yeah. No Excellent. problem at all. It looked okay. just like this. It's got microphones. Oh, God. You, you got a guy in the corner with the headphone on. Mm -hmm. We got a guy like that. Do you need a bed? Uh, preferably, yeah. Okay, we'll, we'll try and sort that. That might be a problem. <laughs> So this is what this is the kind of thing we can expect as guests at the uh, Furchester Hotel. You mind living with a penguin for a few nights? Oh no, actually, that's always been an ambition of mine. Yeah, I've got well, a dinosaur as well. Oh yeah, it's been there for over a million years. Mm. Mm. Good grief! Well, it looks as though old flora and fauna uh, is, is 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 actually here uh, to to experience at the Furchester Hotel, mm -hmm. the brand new children's TV program. It's on CBeebies and it starts this Friday. Uh, so please do please do check it out because it sounds like a fantastic experience and. Uh, a way to see the wonderful uh, Fergus Fuzz, uh, of, of course, the Cookie Monster. Thank the you. Cookie Monster. Thank you very much. Elmo and the rest. Thank you so much for coming in, boys, and I'll see Thanks you at right. Christmas. Uh, yeah, we'll see you. Come and stay. Can't yeah. wait. Brilliant. Live music on the radio can hope to recreate that thing for you. Thank you so much to Fergus Fuzz and to the Cookie Monster. It's a puppy. Uh, of the Furchester Hotel. Make sure you catch them on CBeebies on Friday. That's going to be absolutely fantastic, isn't it? And Sir Marcus says, uh, Muppets on the breakfast show, Sean. Hard to say, more th if more than usual, really, isn't it? I am truly stunned. Uh, as you should be. And just think about that. What has happened this morning on the breakfast show? We brought you the Cookie Monster, Idris Elba, uh, and also Marky Smith. It's incredible, isn't it? Uh, and the, 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 just for a moment, though, to, just to give pause and think about all the wonderful musical luminaries that have appeared on Sesame Street over the years. Uh, you know, everybody from sort of Paul Simon to, uh, you know, to sort of Eric, to, to, to all these people. Why hasn't Marky Smith yet been on? Remonstrating with a Cookie Monster about a keyboard solo or something like that. Somebody make it happen. Sean, Cookie Monster saying that it was a lesson in not, not to eat the guests. Fabulous, funny interview. I was laughing so much, people were staring at Mrs. Mark out of Tunbridge Wells. A lot of people loving uh, Fergus and the Cookie Monster. Uh, and uh, Curly Sue says, Marky Smith and the Cookie Monster show the beginnings of the perfect dinner party guest list. Difficult to teach your children good table manners whilst watching Cookie Monster on the Sesame Street, though. That's the only issue I've got with it. Um, simply brilliant. Right now, from one Muppet to another. BBC Radio. Music News. Six.